Well, the two queen colony. I haven't had a chance to open it yet and see how things are going, but there's least activity on both entrances, and I see foragers going into both entrances. Um, which, I mean, I guess if it was one big hive with just one queen on one side, they would probably still use both sides and both entrances, but that's about all I can tell you for now. I had some people asking for an update, want to know what was going on with it, and, you know, want to know if anything had changed, but I was hoping to open it up here the next couple days if I get a chance. We're supposed to have some pretty bad weather, but then this weekend it's supposed to dry up again, I think, so hopefully I can get in there and have a look. Really, I ought to be looking at it right now instead of just talking about it, but... Uh, I didn't get permission from my wife, so, you know, I just got to wander out here and see how long I can get away with it before I get in trouble for sneaking out without telling her, but, anyway, looks plenty busy. Looks like there's, a, uh, you know, oops, sorry for the fingers. Looks like there's, uh, plenty of good activity, and occasionally if you watch there, you'll see uh, a forager come in with some pollen on, but mostly it's nectar coming in off the Chinese tallow, so, we shall see. Fun little project, I'm excited to see. See what it yields in the end, but just wanted to share that little update on it. Like I said, nothing really changed. You're just looking at a two queen colony, or what was supposed to be a two queen colony. Um, but at least they're still active and they're not dead, I guess.